it's like a, a constant um, battle in my mind. Um, I know people see me as this evil person, I, but I think you know this. I'm not. Uh, well, no, I would say you're a pretty good guy. I've gotten to know you over the last year, and you've been a really good guy to me, you know? I mean, it meant a lot to me. You were there for me when... And even when we were know, on different sides, I reached out to you for Kino Casino, and, yes. and, 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 I, and I said, man, you know what? I hope you kill it. I hope you kill it, and I hope you, and I hope you do well. And I really meant that for you. And... People think I'm so fucking psycho that I would never Dude, say anything like that. I meant that. Talking to the audience, Ralph said that. Yeah, Ralph really did. He was really supportive of when I was going to take the. And by the way, it was the of, casino was, uh, you know, uh, famous for, for trying to frame me for a rape uh, and everything else. And and you know what? I'll say this on air, and I've said it in Portugal. I didn't rape anybody. Alice sucked my dick in the back of my pickup truck, and uh, there was no forcing about it. She willingly took the Ralph the Ralbowski. Uh oh, and geez. um you know I shouldn't have done that because she's disgusting and it was a betrayal of my wife but if you want to know the truth my wife uh gave her blessing for me to fuck around on her. Now I shouldn't I, I shouldn't have taken that. I should have rejected that. But Alice sucked my dick in the back of my pickup truck. Oh, <laughs> for no alcohol, no nothing other than she's a slut. And the only reason she wouldn't fuck me is because she was afraid I would knock her up, which was probably the smartest thing she ever thought of. Um, but um, no, I didn't rape her, uh, but she definitely sucked my dick. And I, I will. Uh, should, should I really get into it, Perspicacity? She sucked it really slow. She sucked it really slow. <laughs> Um, like, I don't know. she sucked it really slow and you know usually it's the uh, rah, 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 rah. um yeah. but i have to give her credit she sucked it so slow that it actually um was <laughs> was quite enjoyable uh to be honest with you because it was it was building the it was it was building the climax the whole time she sucked it so slow she wasn't raped at all all that shit is bullshit she did suck. You're my saying it had a lot of tender, loving care. Is what you're saying? Well, yeah, because there's no dick she won't suck. To be honest, uh, that's another reason not to fuck with her. But um, yeah, she sucked my dick, and I don't have any problem saying it. And you notice there's never right. been any police report filed. There's never been any type of serious accusation on that level because she knows she sucked my dick. Well, and she apologized to Pantsu, which was always like. How could anything have happened? That was why she apologized. Well, she's trying to lie to Pants and Pants and Suster out very quickly. Um, but, yeah. um, you know, because she's a, you know, Alice is a dummy. Uh, and not, and not sorry, says, I do that to my husband sometimes too. LOL. Yeah, I mean, you know, <laughs> women, by the way, women, and, uh, you know, I don't want to spit too much, but women kind of get off a little bit. At least a lot of them do on, on their guys, um, you know having a little fun on the side because uh it means that it means that their relationship is even more valuable than if other bitches right. will suck their you, you understand what i'm saying like that that's what it was um but i didn't rape her you can't even mouth rape somebody that's not even a thing what what are you saying she, uh, she's laying here like this there's no suction on the cock you can't even <laughs> fucking do that do you understand you can't you can't fucking do that it's, it's not enjoyable like what? what no that doesn't work that doesn't work and alice is free to call into this show anytime she fucking wants she knows she sucked my dick i was way too nice to her i did not buy her amazon wish list i bought 100 dollars worth of gifts for her for christmas because i felt sorry for her and you know why i felt sorry for her because somebody bought, somebody actually did buy her entire wish list, and then they canceled it. They canceled oh. it. And so I felt bad for her, and it was Christmas. And, you know, I wouldn't mind getting my dick sucked. And so I, <laughs> and so I, I bought her $100 worth of gifts. $100. I love the honesty here. I mean, this is just all the truth. Like, there, there's no lies here. And I should have known how crazy she was because I hung out with her. And she was talking about she's she's being gang stalked and, um, you know, all these yeah. people are after her. She's actually schizophrenic. And 
I'm not even mad at Alice. If you go look at the casino clips, and I know you know what I'm talking about. Um, yes, she, did. she didn't even claim that until they pushed her into that. And I hope to God you had nothing to do with that. Um, but no, I didn't have anything to do with that. And I believe you. Um, but if you look at her first clip, she says, no, Ralph didn't, Ralph didn't write me. Now that you said that, Ralph, now they're going to say it like this. Say it, say it again. I had nothing to do with that. I really had nothing to do with that whole segment. Uh, I, I don't really even understand where that segment went because it didn't match up with anything that was in the text. Well, because, because the week but, before she said it didn't happen. Like, I mean, you, you know what I mean? No. And, and then, yeah, but then I actually have proof that I said that was fucked up. But now that you said that, you know they're going to say I, I, I was the one that was the mastermind behind but you that. you weren't. Uh, and I don't believe that for a second because you've always been kind to me. And even when we were at I've been at fucking odds. framed somebody for a fake ra for a rape of Al. You know, and Alice even said that Baked, she was literally dating Baked Alaska. And she, he, she said that Baked raped her. And I remember she Baked said, was like, what you guess what else? Dating? She said that Mulatto and that white guy raped her too. And then the sex tape came out and it didn't look like a rape to me. Uh, let's just put it that way. Um, she's very quick to accuse anybody of rape. Uh, and no, I never I raped her. Girl I, well, I, I do regret. You know, I, I do regret. I do regret letting her suck my dick. Um, that's, that's a male thing. And, and I should have had more control over myself. Uh, than to allow that to happen. Uh, well, never stick your dick in crazy, Rob. Well, you're right. And and um, I, I think a lot of the problems with me and my wife kind of started there, to be honest. Frank sent $3 mouth rape is a thing. You weren't married. You weren't married yet. Just to clarify. That's true. I wasn't. Cuddle bubbly. Thank you, Frank. I appreciate that. And no, I wasn't married yet. But um, And I'll tell you another story. Um, <laughs> I was in a car, and I just pulled up to my house in Richmond. And uh, Pansy goes, uh, you want to fuck, you want to fuck Alice, don't you? And I, uh -oh. said, and I said, okay. and, I, and I said, yeah. And uh, and she gave the go ahead, and not only did she give the go ahead, she made out with me and sucked my dick in that car, right then. Uh, it turns her on for that type of thing. <laughs> Whoa, that's some freaking shit, Ralph. Well, you know, maybe I shouldn't maybe I shouldn't say these things, but um that's the truth. That's the truth and that's the God's honest truth. She said, You wanna fuck Alice, don't you? And I said, Yeah. And and she kinda gave me a little shit and she kinda like, you know, pushed me around a little bit. And then she pulled my pants down and sucked my dick live in front of my house. Holy fucking hell. Well, it sounds so, like a dream, but it sounds like a fantasy, right? <laughs> I don't know what to say. Well, it ain't it a fantasy. Like it's a goddamn, it's goddamn nightmare. Fantasy. You know, I wish I'd never done it, but, you know, I did. And her whole family hates me because of that um, and for other reasons. But, uh, no, I didn't rape Alice. And if she has any other claims, uh, otherwise, file the police report, bitch. Uh, and you notice there's never been anything close to that. So, if you have any claims to the otherwise, go file your fucking police report, cunt. Or you could come on here and just tell the truth. You could just you could just tell the truth. Um, but I mean, I mean, I'm, a, I'm ashamed know, of you know myself. I I, I, I'm ashamed of myself for for being for thinking with my dick and not my brain. Um, yeah. But you know, I don't well, have anything to hide. Trap, Say what? I've definitely fallen. I said everybody right. falls into that trap. I've right. definitely fell and, and into you that know, trap. It's 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 my fault for getting myself involved with that. Um, but she sucked my dick in the back of my brand new truck, and then we had a falling out. I got beat up in Portugal, and she was hanging out with Pantsu actually, and wasn't responding to. But you don't know this either. Um, I'm 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 just gonna tell it all. No. I'm just gonna tell it all. Um. When hey, I got on, Ralph. when I got Are you sure you want to tell everything? Yeah, yeah, I want to tell it all. Because all right. Pantsu was completely on board with me taking Alice out for a date when I got back from Portugal. Holy fucking hell. She <laughs> co signed that. She co signed that. And <laughs> and I probably would have done it, but she was um, you know, not uh responding in the way that I thought possible while my eye was fucking bleeding and you know I didn't even know you know what what would be the case for me going forward 
And I, I, I said, I don't want to have anything to do with you, bitch. And the next thing I want to read about you is your obituary. Holy shit. And I told so her. What did she do? She just didn't. She. No. Well, I'll tell you what she did. She was going around okay. to all these, you know, trucker, you know, protests or whatever. And she wanted some yeah. stickers printed. And Pantsu, Amanda, told me. And I didn't want to deal with her, so I put her off on Pantsu. And I said, uh, you know, just deal with it, whatever. And she said, if you don't nip this in the bud right now, she's going to try to hold this over your head forever. And by the way, she was right. Yeah. She was right. Yeah. And Pantsu told her to get fucked again. Well, that was based on Pantsu. Yeah, that was based on Pantsu. And I have a lot of regret uh, of of regrets um of, about my relationship with pantsu um but she was absolutely correct but what did that lead to that lead that led to her going on the casino and accusing me of raping her mouth raping her which doesn't even make any fucking sense you well, know the story didn't mouth, make any sense you know, she's mouth, blocked out but she remembers look, it. listen if your mouth is like this and you can't even fucking like there's no suction on the dick do you understand like you can't even come like that it would have made more sense big supporter up north sent three dollars ooh, ooh tell the true story of jfk next come clean well you know i've never told this full story uh but pantsu was completely turned on by the idea um now you know she ended up not being because alice is a psycho um yeah but um these were things that were told to me that i could indulge in i shouldn't have done it i shouldn't have done it it was a mistake but i did and uh I, i've never you got caught in the temptation yes and i've it's understandable and i've never alice does have some really nice tits i'll give her that i don't know I, I don't, <laughs> yeah, but she's a good looking girl even though she's uh, always looks messed out she's underneath it all she's a good looking girl i think that's what attracts people to her they think yeah. they can, like save and unlike her or something. harry i've sucked on those tits by the way uh so you know unlike harry morris uh who follows her every move not only did i suck on those tits she sucked on this dick so uh you can put that in your pipe and smoke it motherfucker uh yeah yeah oh i sucked on them oh yeah oh yeah i did and oh, my, my, you're, blowing, you're kind of blowing my mind, Ralph. I'm, I, I, you didn't I expect me to, to go say. there. You didn't expect me to drop this, did you? Uh, no. Well, this is all true. And Pants is like, I'm not telling any lies, by the way. Um, she said, you, you, you really want, you, you, you really want to fuck Alice, don't you? And I said, yeah. And she's, and, and she was turned on by it. She was so turned on by it that she sucked my dick in front of my house with no tinted windows like anybody could have seen this she sucked my dick in front of my house holy jeez so, so well apparently she was apparently she was into it too. yes she was into it she wanted to fuck <laughs> alice too like i mean it's it's just you know what i'm tired of the lies i'm tired of you know um acting as if I need to stay silent on these things because I don't, uh, because you don't have a case. And if you did, you'd file it and you're the biggest lying whore that I've ever seen, but you know what? You're mentally ill. And so I can't yeah. really be wish her well. right. She, wish her well, Ralph. She gave you a no, good, it sounds like she gave you a good blow. She did give me a good blow well. job. I, I'll give her, it was really slow. It was really, I, I never had a blow job like that. Actually, it was, it was really slow. And, um, it was really slow and just um, like really caring for the cock. Uh, you know, I, <laughs> I I have to say um, she did give me a good blowjob uh, for sure. Uh, but I did not rape her at all. I don't rape women. Never have. I don't rape men. Rape doesn't do it for me. Right. If, if I if I even thought that I needed to rape somebody, I'm turned off, dude. Like that doesn't get me off what gets me off is a bitch wanting to suck my dick like alice right i mean that's the fun of it yeah yeah and so you know i know they say rapes about power and i guess it is for rapists but i don't i don't get turned on by that 
And right, and that's why guys are attracted to slutty girls because they know that they're they're giving it up and they enjoy it. That's the whole turn on of it. You know what I mean? Right. I mean that's the whole that's the whole turn on of a slut because she's really into it. And he's not phoned in. And she's she was into it. it. My God, she, <laughs> she was she was definitely into it. Uh, and I, I know my chief of staff has to be losing his mind right now. Um, no, I'm sure he's pissed at me too. So it's going to be great. But you know what, Ralph, the truth will set you free. I mean, you know, honesty is the best policy well, as far I, as I'm I concerned. Said, I said a lot of this in, in a Portugal IRL stream, um, but um, I, I, I'm thinking it's going to have more of an effect uh, with me saying it here. And Kina Gay, clip it. I don't give a fuck. Um, uh, because you notice there have been no charges, no reports, no nothing because she willingly sucked my cock. And, uh, you know, that might be hard for you to believe, uh, you know, a shut in like you. Um, but, uh, I, I've never had any problems getting my dick sucked. Uh, now it was a mistake. It was a big mistake and I wish I hadn't done it, but, uh, I wish I hadn't done it because even though my wife, um, said it was cool i i think she felt like i was i was trying to replace her with alice which i yeah. which i wasn't so well that always happens right that always happens with a situation like that or somebody gets real upset like it all of a sudden it's you know you've you you go over the boundary right and then it it's my fault. it was my fault to go dude. back like I, i'm telling this in a funny way and it's all true by the way but um you know it was my fault it was my fault for for thinking even something like that could exist um and you know yeah. i'm like most guys you know threesomes and and more women and uh that, that sounds good yeah. right uh but it's not good it always <laughs> bites you in the ass every fucking it's time not it good. bites you in the it's ass it's not good uh and you know i could tell more stories about how um you know me and pantsu uh, met with a lady of the night in Los Angeles, and all three of us <laughs> fucked. Oh my god! Do you do you really want me to tell all the stories? Oh, um, I don't know. For Pantsu, let's. Uh, I know you're hating Pantsu right now. No, but I don't Pantsu, hate her. I don't hate her, but I'm tired of being lied about. And uh, oh we met with this woman, and you know what she, you know what she told Pantsu, you should be a whore. Is what she told her. Is that sexy? Is was this a sexy escort? Yeah, she was sexy. She was that hot. Was, yeah, she was hot. Yeah. Okay. And she charged like fucking twelve hundred dollars, which would not fly in Mexico. But, uh, uh, <laughs> but uh, yeah, this is all true. This is all true. We met, and all three of us fucked, and they were both sucking my dick at the same time. And so if people want to put it all out there, if people want to uh, try to steal my daughter uh, and want to uh, make up lies about me, including perjury type shit, uh, you know, I really, you know, I don't have a problem putting it all out there. And by the way, there's a lot more I could put out there. Oh, boy. There's a lot more I could put out there, and I'm not going to because... Uh, a, a small part of me still loves my wife and um you know i hate to say that that's my mom talking um it's good to ralph it's good to love your wife and it, she's the mother of your child let's not push this any further i gotta stop you let's not push this any further uh well, i appreciate well, the honesty everything i said was true yeah. everything i said was I true believe, i believe you i believe you, you 100 the dates because i was there um, with Dick Masterson, uh, we did ecstasy and cocaine, me and Pantsu both. Uh, and so, um, you know, the idea that she's some chaste, uh, woman is an absolute just lie. Uh, and by the way, don't do ecstasy and coke, by the way, I'll just give you a little advice. Uh, that's a bad combo, bro. That's a really bad combo. Yeah, that's a really bad combo. Uh, but all this shit that I've just said is true and clip it and put it out there because I don't have anything to hide from because I don't have to fake the deal to be some type of moralistic paragon. Um, but we were there to fuck the whore for one reason, uh, but we stayed with Dick um, and um, 
you know, Dick didn't have anything to do with it. Of course, those weren't his, um, you know, somebody he knew had ecstasy and Coke, uh, and, and, and we did them both and she did them both. And she said, this right. is just like my, pa by the way, she said, this is just like my parents, um, honeymoon. They did Coke on their honeymoon. We didn't get married. Oh this time. I'm not kidding. I'm not, what? I'm not kidding. I swear to God on my life. She said, "Oh, oh, my parents. Oh, they did coke on their honeymoon. This, this, this is the, this is like a, a reenactment of that. And right. s this is all true. Every single fucking word right. of it. And just to verify to chat, this all happened when you guys were in the beginning, when you were dating, and then after. This is well, before I, you got married. So this is before she was. It wasn't time. 2020. Uh, it was 2022, uh, I believe, uh, January." And I can look up the receipts. I mean, it's not really hard to find. But um, yeah, this this was all in 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 January. Twenty twenty one. You mean? Yeah, yeah. We weren't actually married, but she was so stoked because her parents uh, did coke uh, on their honeymoon, and she's just like she she'd never done what? coke. She'd never done coke before, and so she, you know, women love cocaine. You know that. Uh, and yeah. uh, they well, just true, yeah. go crazy like when they're on cocaine. Uh, and this absolutely happened. So you want to put my emails out there? You want to lie about me? Well, I only have to tell the truth about you. And I hope to God. You well, I mean, she was down to freak. I mean, sometimes you got to do some freaky shit. I mean, that's, you know, it was, it sounds like it was a bonding experience. Well, she was a hell of a fuck. <laughs> she, she was a hell of a fuck. I got to give her that. Uh, and uh, you know, I mean, with one of the best asses you could ever imagine. So she was she was down to fuck uh, and just an absolute uh, great lay. Uh, I, I will give her that. Let me play this. Frank sent three dollars. Mouth mean? rape is a thing. Ask chicken, Ask Andy. chicken Andy. Andy Dick is a raw dog. RV cuddle bugly. OK, so and by the way, some people saying some super chats not coming through. Sin Rumble Rants, they already told me they pay me. And if they don't, I'm going to fucking <sighs> be very kind and ask them to do that again. <laughs> uh, but they'll say that they'll pay me at the end of the month. Somehow I got converted to a publisher account. I don't fucking know. Um, but all this is is true. I didn't make up anything. Nothing. Oh, I believe you. Man. Excalibur sent $3. Uh, How much of the party going slut was Ponsu? How was she on cocaine? Did she or was she open to letting you snort coke off of her body? I didn't snort, snort coke off her body because that's a waste of cocaine. Um, <laughs> but, uh, you know, I don't want to lose any, any cocaine. But uh, she was in Vegas with me um, in 2021 when I was doing cocaine. And cocaine is an evil thing for me, and it actually turns me into a completely different person. And I start thinking, like, I'm going to die. I start thinking about, like, I'm, I'm not the funny guy. I'm not the bombastic guy. Uh, and actually, um, Pantsu helped me, and I want to give her truth, too. You, you know what I mean? Like, I don't want to lie uh, and, and say she didn't help me. Uh, because she did help me, um, but yeah, I, I I can get cocaine in in Las Vegas anytime I want, um, and um, I did get some. That's the drug of choice in in Vegas. That's like the drug of choice because everybody wants to just go 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 right. and you want to drink and you just do right. coke and it's strange. Right, but she was yeah. pregnant and she didn't she didn't do anything to to harm our child. I want to be very clear. Uh, she, yeah, well, that's she, what I was she, trying to say before. Yeah, she didn't do anything. She didn't do anything to harm our child. And a matter of fact, uh, all this being said, um, um, I think she's a good mother, and um, uh, she never did anything like that uh, while pregnant. These stories I was telling before were before she was pregnant. So. Um, no, she didn't do anything to harm Rosie. Uh, she didn't do anything to, um, you know, fuck up her pregnancy. She did, she did babysit me because I, I get, you know, people say I'm on Coke or what, dude, you would know if I'm on Coke cause I'm dead silent and I can't even fucking fake it. You, you want to know when I'm on Coke? Go look at the El Paso stream, uh, with Will Herod, <laughs> uh, because I was on Coke on that stream. And 
you, you see me trying to fake it to make it. Uh, but if you go back and watch that stream, I can't even like hardly like control myself because cocaine, when you first start doing cocaine, it's great and it's euphoric and it's awesome. But when you had a serious cocaine problem, like I did during my teens and early twenties, uh, cocaine damages your nervous system. It damages uh, a lot of different things about your body. And I, I can't be on cocaine and do these shows. Uh, and so the one time that I did try it was uh, in El Paso, and I won't say who provided it, but you can probably imagine. Um, yeah. Um, you know, I shouldn't have done that, but, um, you know, I was going through another divorce at that time. And I really, you know, I have a nihilistic streak, Perspicacity. I think you know that. Um, yes, I know. I'm trying to, to, to help you, you know, get through that, you know, because you could say fuck it. It's so easy just to say fuck it, right? It's just so easy to say fuck it. I don't want to deal with it. It's not worth it. You well, know, it's not I really want to. Why are we even here? I mean, literally. I mean, is it really worth it? Like, I, I don't know. I believe well, in sure it is. it's all part of the experience, bro. Yeah. Well, you know what I mean? You tell that, these sounds crazy like cope. that sounds like cope these crazy to me. Stories. That sounds like cope to me. <laughs> um, you think that's and, a cope? And, 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 and you know what? Um, I, I did get back in touch, uh, with religion when my mom died. Uh, and I'll tell you why, uh, it's not because I, I, I changed necessarily, um, all my thoughts about that being, um, you know, not the case. It's because I want to see my mama again. And, um, she was a huge believer and she was a huge believer in me. Yeah. And, um, you know, I hope I'm, I hope I'm not letting her down. And, um, she wouldn't approve of what I just said, by the way. Um, but, but everything I just told you guys is the absolute truth. It's the absolute truth. Pantsu is a cut queen and she got off on the idea of me fucking other women. And that's just true. And, you know, perhaps I could have made some better choices on who to fuck, but, uh, you know what? Really? I shouldn't have even indulged in that in the first place because, um, it wasn't worth it. it. It ruined trust between us and I feel bad for it. Uh, and I know I'm trying to make it funny, trying to make it entertaining, but, um, I, I feel bad for what I did. I feel bad for what I did. Um, and there's no going back, you know, you, you, you can't, yeah. you can't change what you did, but, um, you know, her leaking my emails and, um, trying to spin a story that's false. Nigga, I paid my rent today. You don't have a thousand dollars in your bank, period. Uh, and I paid my rent today. I messaged her earlier and I said, do you have the landlord's number? Because I lost my phone. Can you, can you give it to me? Right? Like, okay. and she didn't. And instead she leaked that to her father to act like I don't have the money to pay my rent. I do have the money to pay my rent. I don't have all my fucking cards to withdraw from the ATM. That's the problem. But I do have an old account and it's called, used to be called transfer wise, but now it's just called wise. And, uh, there's a number, there's a, uh, uh, an acronym here called CABE. And uh, I can wire money to anybody in Mexico with that number. And uh, that's what I did. Okay. And uh, my rent is paid. And I don't plan on ever going back to the United States. Uh, definitely not with anybody knowing it. Um, <laughs> yeah, but that's a good idea. <laughs> and I know you're just stunned that I'm saying all this shit. But... Uh, a little bit, yeah. I'll be honest with you. I'm a little stunned that you're saying it. I, I mean, you know, the truth will set you free, Ralph. I mean, I think well, you're a good guy. You've well, been what's a real the good use guy of to lying me. anymore? Like, I, like, I, 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 it wasn't even that I lied. I just ignored it, right? Um, what, what exactly is the use in that? Um, after they're lying about me, after they're trying to say all uh, these things about me. Well, you know my advice on this. 
you love her you just love her anyway and just let it go because you know it's just accelerating the whole thing well you know i mean you gotta get off your chest what you gotta get as sad as it is i do i do love her and that's pathetic to admit but um it's not pathetic to admit that you love your wife no it's pathetic it's pathetic and um you know, I, I, I wish I could kill that part of me, like I said earlier. Well, Ralph, I there's nothing wrong with that, man. There's nothing wrong with being a human being. I think people appreciate you more and understand you more when you're a human being and you don't have the mask on and you're just honest. Well, I've went full mask on the last 15 minutes and um, everything I've said is the truth. <laughs> Everything I've said is the truth, and people can take it for what it's worth. Uh, I know people, you know, some people hate me or whatever, but um, nothing I've said is untrue. And you know, I think people appreciate when you're real. I think they really do. Uh, you know, it, 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 maybe it's a bit scandalous. I, I don't know, but it's you know everybody. Everybody's hiding in shadows, doing the same shit anyway. You know what I mean? Everybody's pretending they're not doing the shit, and they are. Of course they are. And that's the These people of are it. sicker than I ever thought of being. But Mortis in the chat, not everybody, of course. Some, I assume, are good people. Uh, but Mortis says, if Ralph looks at the chat, at his chat, he will see that everyone is saying that the truth is your only right thing to do toward yourself. God, yes. your mother, JLP, all the people, all people he admires um and you know i've kept quiet on this for a while because it's embarrassing dude it's embarrassing uh and it's also like you know she's threatening to do this and that and try to put me in jail uh well you know you have about 14 false rapes on your record so i'm not really worried about that um so uh you know what alice you need help uh you need to i, I don't wish her well I actually, <laughs> wish you know what? Well. Believe it or not, I do wish her well. I know you don't believe that, but I actually do. I believe that. I actually do wish her I well. I believe that. She's mentally ill. Because I know you personally. Yeah, she's mentally ill. And why even be mad at a person like that? Like, I could be. Uh, you know, I, well, yeah. You know, I, I could do that, but, but why? Like, it, 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 it's a problem she has with her mind. And, you know she needs help I, I don't know what else to say and uh a lot of us do need does help. Uh, you know what i can use with a little help myself probably uh but not as much as her uh and so uh i'll leave it there um uh, but i thought you guys would want to know um a little bit of of the details uh and i already told this the porn star we had on air uh me and pants had both fucked that porn star right before she came on air <laughs> <laughs> I speculated that when it was happening. I said they're totally gonna. And guess fuck this what? Porn she got mad. Right she got mad because uh, I was more <laughs> interested in fucking the porn star because you know I don't get to fuck porn stars, and uh, I pulled I pulled yeah. out and busted all over her you know body, uh, and Pantsu got so upset that she left the room. Oh and, fuck! Yeah, and. Um, yeah, that actually, I fucking knew you fucked that porn star, Ralph. I said it on the thing. The way that you were looking at her, I knew you fucked her. I fucked just her. like I knew, I just like her. I knew when you met up with Digi Bro that you were fucking Pantsu. I knew the fucking way that you were looking at her. I said he's definitely fucking Pantsu. There's no way. I fucked her. <laughs> you know when a man I looks at a woman, and she was a good, a she was a good fuck, by the way. Um, but um, you know, it was like. This is always the problem, by the way. Uh, one woman thinks they're not getting enough attention. She's a paid whore. Yes. Like, she doesn't care whether I pay her, her any attention or not. But, uh, you know, my future wife-to-be thinks that it's an insult. It was actually just me, you know, getting my fun in, right? Like, it, 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 wasn't, it wasn't anything to do with her. I, you know, even now, I just said I love her. Even after she stole my child, I still love her. Um, but you know, it was a porn star and, uh, yeah, I definitely, I definitely busted. It was a large one too. It was a large one too. It was, it was all over her, her torso and tits and everywhere. Um, so, um, 
and then if you watch the interview it was way darker than me fucking her like i mean she was taken advantage of big time uh yeah and i feel bad for her honestly and so i'm not trying to bring her into this but uh but yeah i absolutely fucked her she wanted a certain <laughs> fee so she wanted 900 dollars to both come on the show and to fuck us and okay I, and i paid it we're just going at it now well that's true so well you want the truth you want the truth that's the truth 900 huh i figured she'd be more expensive than that well, only 900 I mean, bucks for that she's kind of a you know black type person, so, you, know. <laughs> you know you can only charge so much you can only charge so much uh when you're on that level but uh super chat go Excalibur ahead caliber sent three dollars ponsu was all about sitting in the corner and watching her man bang other women yes how far did her cuck fetish go people with a cuck fetish usually have no self-esteem or self-respect oh. You know, the last message, and I don't have it saved, uh, was her wanting me to fuck another woman in front of her um, as like a super turn on. She wanted to see my dick going somebody else's pussy. Um, and that's absolutely true. And she can't deny it because she knows it's true. Oh, my God. And I, I know I shouldn't be saying all this, but I don't care anymore. You know what? You want to lie about me? You want to act like you're this paragon of virtue? You're not. You're absolutely well, not. I don't know. I, I, yeah. Well, it's the truth. You know what I mean? People respect the truth. So, uh, you know. Thank you for watching this clip. This is the CACA Lofa. Remember to like and subscribe.